Question comes on having the bill passed to be engrossed. The chair recognizes Mr. Kelkos of Amesbury. Uh, I am very fortunate, but there are not there are those who are not as fortunate uh, as we are all here today. Uh, domestic violence is a very serious issue. It's a serious issue in my hometown where 463 cases last year and the year before uh, were reported by the Amesbury Police Department. In fact, Detective Bob Weil of the Amesbury PD uh, has his hands full, and he needs our support. And that's why Salisbury does a terrific job in administering this money that has been budgeted, $20,000, to help curb domestic violence and violence against women. In fact, the program's so successful that Salisbury, Newburyport, and Amesbury traveled to all parts of this country, Florida, California, New Mexico, North Carolina, and New York, to name a few, to educate fellow law enforcement officers on how to handle domestic assault cases. I am proud to say that we have not had a domestic homicide in the city of Amesbury since 2002 when Dorothy's case happened. And hopefully we will never have a domestic homicide or even a domestic violence case again. So with your support and with your vote of this important amendment, I would appreciate it if you will join me and taking one step further to ending domestic violence and violence against women, just not here in the great state of Massachusetts, but in the country and, is in, this, and in this world. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.